NBA, when big guys match up, it's all about the power. But this contest is about finesse. Who can outplay and outsmart the competition? Here are the five for the Suns. All the stars on the floor for the Suns. Booker and Beal, the backcourt, and KD up front. Yusuf Nurkic is out there with Grayson Allen. On the wing, Durant. For three. And it's Holmgren with a rebound. Yeah, and the defense has really got to tighten up on him. I mean, he's just too dangerous from the three-point line. From deep, Gilgis Alexander. Ooh, it's stolen by Gilgis Alexander. Pass to Williams. Back to Gilgis Alexander. Outside for Dort. Holmgren with it. Five on the clock. Here's Gilgis Alexander. And it's Phoenix with the rebound. Grant, usually the Suns rack up lots of assists. They're a team that values ball movement. Oh, B.A., that's how you create quality looks. By snapping the ball around, it also tells you something about how selfless these guys are. Down low. Allen outside. There's the triple. They grab their own miss. Nurkic finds Durant. Count that bucket. Uh, Nurkic getting more and more comfortable at finding the open men on this team. Booker against Gilgis Alexander. Fires the three. And again, Oklahoma City, no good. And he just hasn't been able to get it going this period. No, I haven't seen him in, in comfortable spots, or at least spots we've seen in this offensive set that are allowing him to settle in. He was all alone on that one. Well, on top of just flat-out scoring, Booker can really pick apart defenses. Takes the three, and Gilgis Alexander gets the three. Gilgis Alexander's got five now. These teams are finding the range, showing a lot of confidence. It seems like they're going to find out who can make the deepest threes. Right now, it's a shootout. For three, Allen. And it's Holmgren with a rebound. For Oklahoma City, they've gone two of six to open up this game. The kick out to Williams. Gilgis Alexander from outside. Oh, the Thunder, another three! Well, the focus here from SGA at the arc. He hates to waste those opportunities. Here's Booker. And he drops it in from the low post. When a player gets a feel for that floater, you can really make things tough on defenders. You're just not sure how to guard him and where your point of commitment is. Giddy passes to Williams. Gilgis Alexander against Durant. Dort right side. Outside, Williams. Here's Giddy. And there's another one for the Thunder. Impressive decision there as Giddy just shot that one. No hesitation. You know, for my money, Josh Giddy is one of the most entertaining players of the league, Grant. Yeah, he has superb vision in the open floor, B.A. Reads the angles and sees how plays develop with ease. His teammates have to be ready for a pass from Giddy at all times. Sure, from three-point range. Revenge. Alexander coming right back for three of his own. The three, Durant. That one's good. Give the assist to Booker. Give him eight points now. Starting to find his rhythm. He's cooking, and he knows it. Yeah, right now, I don't see any let-up. I think he's going to just keep putting his foot on that gas pedal tonight. Ooh, took him no time at all to get that one. He's making plays all over the floor. Gilgis Alexander will not be stopped. Outside for Booker. And the Suns get another three. He's consistent from out there, especially when you give him that kind of room. And it's Gilgis Alexander on the drive. The three. Oh, the Thunder, another three. It's just incredible. I mean, he's really making it rain out there, knocking them down one after another. Kind of like he's in his living room right now. He's found a comfort zone. Once he gets that, the defense knows they're in trouble. Man, that's his shot. Maybe he was too wide open. About seven seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Williams, a screen on Booker. From deep, Gilgis Alexander. No good there. Six for 11 now from the floor. Beal outside. 
Here's Nurkic. Stolen by Giddy. The three. Oh, got it off in time, but it's no good. What a performance for Shea Gilgis Alexander. And some good action in the books as we get back to a game that's been pretty close so far here. And what do you guys think about the Thunder here in this one? Well, you have to love their activity level at the defensive end. Racking up those steals. You know, they really made a lot of good quality reads down there. Took some chances, but feeling more calculated than risky. They've got Gordon Hayward, and it's Williams in at the center, locking down the middle. That's the lineup out there for the Thunder. Plenty of daylight on that shot. Yeah, when Hayward has the ball, he watches all the angles. That's how he finds wide open guys to feed. And Grant, when you scan the OKC roster, you see length at every position. Yeah, it's definitely their philosophy, B.A. We're seeing a number of franchises going that route. What I would say about the Thunder, though, many of their guys still have some strength to add. Thunder with a lead. A moment to hear from Ali LaForce. Well, Kevin Durant talked about what keeps him going. He said, quote, simply put, I enjoy hooping. I like when the ball goes through the rim, working on my game, building with the team. It gives me joy that I crave. A kid like energy. So I'm going to keep chasing that feeling. And the second that goes away, I'll call it quits. Brian? Ali, thank you. Clock at two. Joe misses. And even though he couldn't send the shot back at him, he certainly altered it. Yeah, that's the kind of energy that you want to see on every possession throughout the game. Okogi, the pass to Little. Eubanks with it. And stolen by Williams. It's a three-on-three -three fast break. Joe misses. Phoenix has gone four of nine so far from the perimeter. Little. Three-pointer, O'Neal. That one goes. Now he's one for two. That's the kind of passing you want there. Work the ball around. Keep it moving. Try to get an assist on every bucket. Wiggins outside. There's the drive. Hayward attacking. Here's Joe. No made baskets yet. Down to five on the shot clock. Pass to Wallace. Pulls up. And again, Oklahoma City, no good. Phoenix has gone 5 of 10 from beyond the three-point line in this game. Nice shot by Okogi. That's nice vision there. You see that pass, you make the feed before the defense has a chance to react, and that opens up a, a much better opportunity to score. The kick out to Wiggins. Here's Joe. Back to Wiggins. Driving inside. Pass to Wallace. Let's it go from deep. Wiggins, no good. And this is exactly who you want taking that shot. I just missed it. Yeah, when it comes to Royce O'Neal, there's a reason this guy plays Royce big minutes, Grant. Well, B.A., it's all because he has the trust of his teammates and his coaches. Just a high IQ guy who never plays in a rush. Out to Hayward. And he drives in. Wiggins passes to Joe. To halt the run. Counted from distance. Joe's got his first three points of the game. <laughs> this game has been like a seesaw. Both teams going back and forth at one another. Yeah, everybody trying to get away from one another, and the threads are keeping them close. This has been highly competitive. A minute and a half left to play in the first half. Pass to Wallace. From deep, Hayward. And again, Oklahoma City with a triple. Yeah, a quality shooter from beyond the arc. Can't let Hayward get room to fire from the corners. Gordon, the pass to Little. Okogi on the wing. And the basket is good. Well orchestrated. And then the pass is right on the money. Hayward, left side. Ball stolen. It's Little on the wing. Three-pointer. He buries it from three. Little's got five points now this quarter. Good focus. Nasir not letting anything distract him from letting that one rip. And there's the 
There's the call on Drew Eubanks. That's his first foul of the game. And yeah, he, he still was moving at the point of contact. Stripped away. Here's Okogi. Oh, a huge slam! An exclamation point on that break. Oh, that's impactful defense right there. Finding a steal and instantly turning it into offense. Wallace, the pass to Hayward. Here's Wallace, defended by Gordon. Clock at six. The kick out to Wiggins. Over Gordon. That one's wide left. Here's Okogi. Pass to O'Neal. Takes a three. And the Suns get another three. Can't talk enough about the subtleties in that setup right there. The assist really the key to that entire sequence. And so it's Phoenix leading by six. As we wrap. Thanks very much, Allie. And folks, we'll be right back to start the second half of this game. First half, we saw a pretty tight battle. We'll soon find out what sort of adjustments were discussed during halftime. You know, Shea Gilgis Alexander has been exceptional here, guys. Can they come up with an answer for him coming out of the half? They have to change something defensively. It's yeah, just way too easy out there, and I'm sure coach is going to make that a priority at halftime. Second half underway. Here's who Frank Vogel's got on the floor. All the stars on the floor for the Suns. Booker and Beal, the backcourt, and KD up front. Grayson Allen is out there with Yusuf Nurkic. Holmgren, a pass to Williams. Ford outside. Outside, Williams. Outside for Gilgis Alexander. Williams with the screen. Gilgis Alexander finds Williams. Gilgis Alexander showing more signs of him being comfortable in that pick and roll setting. And you look at the Thunder. Talk about a team that's drafted well. It's hard to see out the window in Oklahoma City with how much they stockpile their picks in that front office. It's about making good use of them, B.A. When are they going to plant a flag in the ground that these are our guys moving forward? They have some young studs. I'm curious about when that time is. Wide open look. And he hits the jumper. Gilgis Alexander's got 18 points in the game. It's funny how much the defense has to focus more on not leaving their man when Giddy has the ball. Booker just shredding the D. You know, you just love to start the second half this way. What a play call. Halftime talks can go all over the board, but right there coming out, that's the way you want to start the half. Be aggressive. From deep, Gilgis Alexander, and stolen by Durant. Allen with it. Now Gilgis Alexander defending. Durant, no good. That's the shot you hope for. Right at the rim, just couldn't capitalize. Williams passes to Holmgren. Outside for Gilgis Alexander. Just five on the clock. Into the lane. Oklahoma City's got to hurry. They got to get up a shot. And that one's good. Giddy. Trying to get more comfortable from deep. Giddy looking solid on that one from three. Pass to Durant. Here's Nurkic. Beal outside. Outside Durant. And a foul call on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. It's going to go on Shea Gilgis Alexander. I think he just has a great feel for what the defender is thinking. Durant using the up fake there to draw the foul. Well, Brent, Durant is at the point of his career where we can discuss if he's one of the best ever. I don't think that you could argue that. He certainly has all of the accolades, B.A., All-Stars, titles, MVPs, finals MVPs. On that 75th anniversary team, just stack them all up. He's right there. The score now all even. Now that's what this team needs offensively from Dort, just spacing the floor. The kick to Durant. 
We've got 155 left in the third. Pass to Nurkic. Booker for three. Nurkic finds Booker. Fade away. And it's Kitty with a rebound. Clean look from mid-range. Coach will probably want to run that play again. A big triple. Giltis Alexander. Their strategy has been pretty simple here in the second half. Attack from three-point range. Maybe trying to find a little bit more space and ball movement to get guys open at the three-point line. All right, let's get a report from Allie. Brian, the new leadership for the Suns is proving to be aggressive right from the jump. Within days of new ownership taking over, the blockbuster trade for Kevin Durant was executed. The luxury tax bill increased, but the message from the Suns' top brass was we're focused on winning and not money. Money follows success, be it? No doubt about that. And with Beal in the mix, they are all in. I mean, I'm just not sure what he was thinking right there. I mean, he needs to get his head in the game. A line change here for Oklahoma City. Out to Gordon. Pass to Okogi. Here's Little. They get the rebound. Great positioning on the putback. I always love the hard work on the glass. Just great activity. Wallace, the pass to Williams. Here's Wallace, defended by Gordon. Going inside. Here's Wallace. Out left to the wing. Here's Joe. Offline with a three. Phoenix has gotten nothing to fall from outside in this third quarter. About seven seconds separating the shot and game clocks. And here's Gordon from the arc. The rebound by Wiggins. For Oklahoma City, they've gotten six of eight shots to go and looking good since the break. Wallace, the pass to Wiggins. Here's Wallace. The kick out to Williams. An open look for Hayward. He gets it up. Ooh, he released it in time, but it's off the mark. What a performance for Shea Gilgis Alexander. He has been the... And it's time now to bring you our State Farm assist to the game. And I'll tell you what, this was a no-brainer tonight. Take a look at the precision on this feed. Couldn't place it any better. Well, there's a way to break down the defense with the handle, but you can do it with the pass. Prime example of that right there. Well, this has been a great contest so far. I imagine the fourth quarter could have more action in store for us. They've got Gordon Hayward, and it's Williams in at the five, down low. That's the lineup for Oklahoma City. The kick out to Williams. Gilgis Alexander on the wing. To the inside. That's good from Giddy on the assist from Gilgis Alexander. Gilgis Alexander's got his fourth assist in this one. Booker against Gilgis Alexander. Holmgren with a screen on Nurkic. From deep, Gilgis Alexander. Outside for Dort. The three. Pass to Williams. From deep, Gilgis Alexander hits a three-pointer. Gilgis Alexander's got 27 points. Coach likes that look. And Gilgis Alexander from the corner. Leo, the pass to Allen. Duran with a screen on Gilgis Alexander. Such a wide open look. Oh, you gotta love the back and forth, showing real confidence at the heart. They're both teams finding ways to the three point line and trying to take advantage from distance. Dort, the pass to Williams. Outside for Dort. Launches it. Oh, the Thunder, another three. Uh, the size and skill of Dort is pretty unique. Could be really effective at any position on the floor. Outside Durant. 4 3. And it's Kitty with a rebound. And you just can't afford to give up that kind of look very often. Fades. Rebounded by Nurkic. Nurkic just got his fifth rebound in this one. Durant against Williams. Durant's shot is off. And 
Kitty has got the ball here for the Oklahoma City Thunder. They've played a great fourth quarter defensively, allowing only three points. And great awareness. Holmgren's so good at reading the movement of his teammates, a very heady passer for a big man. KD splashes the triple. Oh, what great action we've seen tonight. Hard to imagine a more entertaining game. No, this is about as high octane a game as you're going to find. Yeah, that one's cool. Gilgis Alexander's got 16 in the second half. Heads up ball there from Dort. For three, Booker. The Thunder with the rebound. Giddy's got rebound number five here tonight. From deep, Gilgis Alexander. Offensive rebound. Kitty with a screen on Booker. And stolen by Booker. Two and the Suns minutes, pushing it up now. Two minutes. Pass to Allen. And stolen by Holmgren. Pushing it up the floor. Here comes Oklahoma City. Allen on the wing. And here's Booker. Stolen by Giddy. Pushing it up the floor. Here comes Oklahoma City. He'll just Alexander from outside. The Suns clear it. Booker fires from way outside. And the Suns miss again. Holmgren with it. Nurkic picks him up. Giddy passes to Gilgis Alexander. From the arc. And again, Oklahoma City no good. The Suns trailing. For three, Booker. Dort grabs the miss. Not a way to get out of the funk. He needs to be looking for good, solid, more efficient shots. Not the wild one he took there. And that one's good. Gilgis Alexander. And a comfortable win for them here. Game is out of reach. Time for the fans now to celebrate a win for the Thunder. And at first glance, it appeared to be an easy win for them. However, they had to weather some storms along the way, Greg. Yeah, in terms of competitiveness, it was a lot closer than the final score indicates. And when you look at the game, the one thing that helped fuel this team to victory was the efficiency for Shea Gilgis Alexander. Well, those points he had tonight, all critical, all from energy and activity. He just never seemed to stop. Pocket four. The three ball. Rebounded by Nurkic. And the ball out of play. The Thunder will have it. Here are the Thunder with the ball. They're on a 16-6 run. Gilgis Alexander with the ball. From deep three-point range. And so it's the Thunder taking care of business in this one. This one was a fun one to watch. They were clearly in the driver's seat down the stretch.